Sierra Bolinski found her calling. I belong on the field. I belong on the mound. I belong in the dugout with my team. Ooh. The road to this spot, starting pitcher for the South Carolina Beaufort Sand Sharks, was full of obstacles, even more than a typical athlete may face. She's been through some things that most people don't go through in a lifetime, and she's 21 years old. The South Florida native thought she found her new home at Georgian Court University in New Jersey. Then, in the fall of 2017, her dad died unexpectedly. Softball took a back seat. I ended up taking that next semester completely off because I couldn't deal with all the emotional part of that. The plan was always to work her way back onto the field. It's what her number one fan, the man who introduced her to this sport, would have wanted. Then she tore her ACL. And there are some times, like I will be honest, that I think about, like, maybe I should just hang them up. Like, maybe I should just be done. But I love it way too much. And the connection with my dad is way too strong to just give that up. But she couldn't do it at GCU. Every time she stepped on campus, she was reminded of the devastating news she received in 2017. She needed a home. She needed a, a fresh start, a second chance. That's where USCB came in. Belinsky enrolled fall 2020. Her first game in a Sand Sharks uniform, she combined for a no hitter. Absolutely unreal. It had taken so long. Like my journey had been so long and it was right in front of me and it was so humbling and amazing to have a home and a place to do that at. With all that joy comes the sad realization the one person she wants in the stands most can't be there. I struggle with that a lot. I just want to call my dad and tell him that I knew he would be watching. I knew he'd probably honestly be here. It's only six hours. She always talks about, I just wish my dad could be here. I wish he could see it. And, you know, I truly believe and she truly believes that he, he is seeing it and he is here. Every time she looks to her wrists for a pitch sign, she'll see the tattoo with her dad's number on the left and on the right. The last letter he wrote her in his handwriting, telling her you can do anything. Sierra's team, who's become more like family, preaches the same message. If she can get through the things that she's been through, she can get through anything on the softball field. And so it just speaks to her resiliency, her strength, and just who she is as a person.